Hi guys, Merry Christmas everybody. <laughs> Merry Christmas. I hope you guys are doing amazing. I know it's Christmas, so I'm bringing you this super amazing face cream recipe that I am going to be sharing with you. So just keep on watching and enjoy the video. So it is Christmas Day, 25th of December, 2022. And I thought, why not just share this recipe with my people, okay? And I am doing this at 12 a.m. So, first of all, we need our scale, but make sure that you are practicing good manufacturing practices, okay? So we need a beaker, a beaker that you can use to put your products in, right? So if you have any other container that you would like to use, please go ahead and use it, okay? So our first ingredient here is going to be water and water here is used primarily as a solvent in cosmetics and personal skincare. And it helps to dissolve many of the ingredients that we use in our skincare products and it also has a lot of benefits like condition the skin which um it also helps to form emulsions in which the oil and water components of the products are combined to form creams and lotions okay yeah so uh, next we are going to be using giga white giga white powder is an effective natural plant derived skin lightening and brightening agent or additive it's also known to fade and prevent dark spots hyperpigmentations age spots and sunspots and this can help to give you a polished glow and even complexion this active is a plant derived active so it is natural and it is soluble in water and it is used at the ph of at least two to five percent now it is stable under a wide range of ph between three to six and uh, it is compatible with many other lightning actives ingredients including vitamin c sepi white alpha abatine kojic acid and l glutathione amongst many others now do not add giga white powder to products or formulations that contain lactic acid or alpha hydro hydroxy acid as this can affect the ph balance of the product remember that the ph of this product is between three to six point five okay so you want to make sure that anything you're formulating with this active you are getting your ph within three to six point five yeah so now i'm adding this in a different beaker because um this takes this needs a higher temperature to dissolve so i'm not going to add that into the water directly so here we have our niacinamide and what this active does is it helps to build cells in the skin while also protecting the skin from environmental stress such as sunlight pollution and toxins now this ingredient can also treat acne and it may help to you know treat severe acne especially inflammatory forms like purples um, and pop tools and over time you may see fewer lesions and improved skin texture and i love to use this product in my formulations because it just gives you that balance that you need in your formula okay now i'm going to add that into the water directly and you will see that this begins to dissolve completely now with niacinamide you do not need any form of heat or any of that to dissolve it and you can definitely add this at the cool down phase of your formula as well but i am adding this um in the water phase of our formulation and i am going to explain to you in the future how i intend to protect the integrity of this product because it is not very very compatible with a lot of heat but it can withstand some heat okay next we are using alpha abutin which is also called bd glucoperonicide and this is a naturally occurring antioxidant and skin brightener that is naturally found in yeah, berry plant i think yes and it helps to reduce melanin formation it helps to improve the appearance of age spots freckles melasma 
and post-inflammatory pigmentation. And um, this product can be used in your face cream, body cream, and other formulas that you may want to produce that combats um, pigmentations and basically giving you a glowing and beautiful skin tone, okay? Now, this product is also water soluble and you can use this product up to 2%. Again, this ingredient does not need a lot of um, heat to dissolve. You can see that it dissolves completely into the water and gives a clear um, um, liquid with the product in it. You don't need to add so much um, water, uh, so much heat to dissolve this product. Again, in the future, you will see where I you know, protect the integrity of this product. Furthermore, we are going to be using Sepi White, but this particular Sepi White is water soluble, right, guys? It's a water soluble um, Sepi White, which has, which was um, produced or made to help with proper absorption into the skin. And this particular um, Sepi White is more um biodegradable okay so it is best for your skin and it helps it penetrates deeper than the oil soluble sepi white now sepi white is a very popular a very popular skin lightening and brightening ingredient which demonstrates effectiveness in many clinical studies that i have read it is compatible with many other ingredients and it's suitable for all skin types now add to the heated water phase of your formula you won't have any issues now after that i'm going to add some of the water into the giga white that we have um, measured out earlier now the reason why i'm doing this is because giga white is a water soluble active yes you have to kind of dissolve it in a very high temperature which um i didn't want to do with the other ingredients in the water um, phase so i separated that now next this ingredient is a secret ingredient that is going to be revealed to you in our upcoming class now i know a lot of people say eh if you don't want to show us then why are you putting it on the screen eh, it's my video i'll do whatever i want to do okay this particular ingredient i am going to talk about it in our upcoming class so if you want to learn about this particular ingredient and how powerful it is and how you can use it then you want to go ahead and register for our upcoming skin whitening specialist class in that class i'm going to teach you how to make skin lightening products skin whitening products how to pro mix your natural whitening products to get extreme whitening 5d 6d 8d whitening results and so many other pro um, products that are going to be taught we're going to be doing face um, face creams we're going to be also learning about soaps different kinds of soap bar soaps um, facial soap cream soap and so many other things we're also going to be teaching you about our serums how to make serums how to make base creams and so many other things if you want to learn more definitely send me a whatsapp message using the link down in the description bar all right yeah <laughs> okay now we're moving on to our oil phase and we're going to be using this beaker Again, you can use any heat resistant container that you have. I like to use Bika because, because they are cleaner and you know more professional looking. And the first ingredient we're going to be using is our Lotion Pro Emulsifier. This emulsifier is also called Tego Care 165 or Lotion Pro 165 when and this emulsifier is non-ionic and it is suitable for formulation of oil and water creams and lotions it has excellent compatibility with active ingredients and can tolerate significant amount of electrolytes and is um, applicable in a wide range of ph meaning it stays stable in a wide range of ph and it it is a self emulsifier because it also contains glyceryl sterate and pg10 sterates okay and we are also going to be using cetyl alcohol which is going to act as a stabilizer in this product which we really don't need 
but i'm just adding it for thickness because with lotion pro you get a very thin um, um lotion or thin consistency so if you want a thicker consistency you may have to increase the percentage of your lotion pro or add is a thickener or a gum that will help the um, consistency or the viscosity of your product so here i am adding um, cetyl alcohol and um, steric acid now if you like to learn the basics of skincare formulation get the background knowledge about how to create your formulas how to convert your formulas to recipes how to know the categories of in, uh, ingredients that are there in skincare formulation then you definitely want to get our ebook now i'm going to go ahead to add my oils for this i am using jojoba oil i'm also using um aloe vera oil but you can use a blend of oils that you need you don't have to necessarily use the same oils that i'm using here you will still get the same good result you can also go ahead to use olive oil which i think i added some olive oil in this formula as well because i try to um separate the the percentage of my oils so i think i used olive oil jojoba oil and um uh, aloe vera oil now like i said you can use a blend of oils that you want but make sure that these oils are oils that you can use for your face and if you don't have a sensitive skin then you you don't have any problem but if you have a sensitive skin you may have to be careful with the kind of oils that you use so you don't go ahead to clog your pores okay Now, if you have watched up to this extent and you haven't subscribed to my channel, what are you waiting for? <laughs> Take this time, pause this video, go down, subscribe down below, make sure you give this video a thumbs up, share it to your friends, family, and leave your comments if you have any questions about trainings, about the ingredients in this video, any problems at all, just leave a comment in the comment section and I will definitely respond to you and help you as much as i can okay now after adding all my oils my emulsifiers my thickeners i am going to go ahead and add my other actives that are going in the oil phase now remember we have actives that go in the water phase and we also have actives that go in the oil phase and for this we are using kojic acid depalmitate now kojic acid depalmitate it the palmitate is a more stable derivative of kojic acid and it is oil soluble it's, it has a wider ph and it is compatible with ingredients that have higher ph um, range so you don't have a problem with using this product even in your black soap you can add this because it has a ph that can withstand um, um it has a wide ph so it can withstand you know ph from that are up to eight so i'm adding this here for the benefits of skin lightening brightening it also helps with um, wrinkles dark spots and other discolorations that may that you will experience so now we have our oil phase our water phase and other phases that we're going to work with now let me tell you something i will advise you to heat up your giga white powder separately because this particular giga white that i got from this particular manufacturer this it needs a higher um, temperature to dissolve completely so you definitely want to um, heat this particular giga white powder separately so you don't damage the integrity of the other water soluble ingredients that you have added in your water phase but here i have coconut head i went ahead and i added it but i made sure that my heated phase for my water is at a certain temperature that will not damage the other ingredients that are there so while we're waiting for our oil and our water phase to heat up to the temperature that we need to make our emulsions we are going to be working on our cool down phase and 
or our cool down phase i am adding some extracts this particular extract is mulberry extract mulberry extracts are basically known for natural skin replenish and brightening properties and it can help to reduce the appearance of scars age spots and other forms of discoloration that are you know driven by sun exposure or the aging process we're also going to be adding aloe vera juice aloe vera juice is a very good moisturizing ingredient it helps to um condition the skin it helps to fight acne eczema and sunburn and it can also help to protect the texture and integrity of the skin we are also going to be adding alpha bisopolo which helps to calm the skin and reduce redness and irritation it helps to um, calm psoriasis rashes and so many other skin conditions it can also help to reduce discomforts that are caused after you walk under the sun and it is sometimes used as a mild sunscreen as well and don't forget that all these actives and ingredients that i've used here also have some nice moisturizing effect and i went ahead to also add ceramide which basically acts as um, a glue kind of that holds our skin cells together and it helps to keep our skin barrier intact and healthy and it also helps to seal in moisture and seal out harmful elements okay now i'm also going to go ahead and add my preservative and i always like to use you know preservatives that are easy for you guys to um, access and that is Jamal Plus. Jamal Plus, you can use it in both oil and um, water so, um, based ingredients or based products. So I'm using that because it is accessible, it is easy to use, it is a wide range um, um, preservative. So after that, we are going to add a vitamin E, which is also an ox antioxidant that helps to protect the oils in the product and also sometimes help to protect the um, integrity of the other ingredients. And it can also act as an antioxidant that helps to fight free radicals and any environmental damage that may be caused to the skin so here i am adding my um secret ingredient i talked about this ingredient in my other video it is used to clear any form of dark spot i call it our natural skin perfector serum it is a naturally made product we made it here in our lab you can't find it anywhere else and if you want to buy this product you can use it in your knuckle creams and you will have amazing results you will it will clear out your knuckles in as little as 10 7 to 10 days and it can clear out dark feet it can clear out dark spots just buy small and try it 100 ml is 18,000 naira. now go ahead and add your oil into your water phase and just give that a burst several times to create your emulsion like I said earlier, this particular emulsifier that I used here, the Lotion Pro or Tego Care 168, is a very, very, it gives a very thin, um, milky consistency. So if you're looking for a thicker cream, maybe you should you should substitute the Tego Care with maybe Olive Olive M um, 1000, or you can use other emulsifiers that are that give a more thicker creamy consistency but this is what i was going for i was going for a more milky kind of tech um result so i used the tego care or lotion pro emulsifier you can also add thickeners like um xanthan gum or you can use cetyl alcohol and use them at a higher percentage in this formula i use them at a milder percentage because i know that i'm not really going to be pro mixing this product so i used this particular emulsifiers now go ahead and make sure everything is completely stirred everything is completely emulsified and then 
cover your product for a while for it to cool down so that you can go ahead and add your cool down phase now um, I have left this to cool down for a few hours and I am now going to go ahead and add my cool down phase which includes all of the other ingredients okay you can see the consistency of the product it's not so thick it's just perfect the way I want it by the time I add my other ingredient, it will be runnier. But as the days go by, after like 24 hours, you would see that it begins to thicken up again and give us a more milky. It doesn't give a creamy consistency, but it gives a more milky consistency. This product is good for sports, anti-aging, brightening. It will give you at least two to three shades lighter but if you want this product to give you a more whitening effect then you want to go ahead and get our porcelain water or um, our porcelain concentrate to incorporate in it to give you a more whitening effect but this product will give you a glowing beautiful complexion on your face and your neck and you will definitely see feel the result as you Go ahead to use it consistent, consistently and frequently. Now, this is Alantoin powder. I'm using this basically as a moisturizer and also a sunblock. So you can definitely use this product in the daytime, in the nighttime, whenever you want to use it without the fear of sun damage. Okay, go ahead, mix that up. Make sure you thoroughly mix it. And then next we add our... Skin Perfector Serum, our natural pink skin perfector serum. This, this serum is a game changer. And if you want to get this product, we are already out of stock. Let me just tell you now, we're already out of stock for this product. I posted a video with this product on our previous um, post and we're already out of stock. So if you want to be among the first people to get this product in January, you definitely want to Put your orders in 100 ml is 18,000 naira. And this product is good for um, dark knuckles, dark spots, dark feet. So if you have, if you want to make money and treat by treating people's dark knuckles, this product is the product that you need. This and nothing else. This product and nothing else. This is all you need. So go ahead and add that into this product. And our final product is urea. Now we know that this is a whitening product, but you don't want to leave out moisture. You want to make sure that this product is hydrating. It will moisturize the skin. So we're using urea. Now, <laughs> urea is a natural moisturizing agent and it is a humectant, which means that it is able to absorb moisture from the environment and draw it to the skin. In addition, urea is also an emollient that softens and smoothens the skin. Now, I didn't add this in the water phase because urea is heat sensitive. So you want to make sure you are adding this product on its own. You can dissolve it in cool water and you won't have any issues. Just dissolve it, it will dissolve completely. And then you go ahead and add it into your mixture and yeah that's basically it for this for this recipe or for this video go ahead mix in your urea add it into your product and voila you have yourself a nice mm, whitening moisturizing hydrating face cream that will help to clear out dark spots wrinkles knuckles and basically helps to whiten your skin naturally now you can definitely use this product on your hands as well you can use it on your body but this is made for the face this is this recipe is made specifically for the face but it doesn't mean you can't use it on your body you definitely can okay yeah merry christmas again guys i hope you guys are enjoying your christmas and i will see you guys in my next video go ahead and you know keep this product for 24 hours make sure you check the ph of your product you want to make sure your ph is within five to six on the ph scale and you are good to go bottle your product in a 
pump bottle and you will have a very very convenient use of this product okay all right <laughs> happy christmas or merry christmas and a happy new year in advance i will keep bringing you videos as the days go on and it is bye bye from me for now and i'll definitely most definitely see you in my next video bye <laughs>